Hey everybody, the Bonga is back. Welcome to part 9 of Let's Play Neo 2, the first Samurai DLC. Alright, so we are back here to Dawn of the Demon, and I'm doing this on Dream of the Samurai to make it a lot easier. Um, we got to do a few things. First off, we got to find the Kadama that I missed. And outside of that, we got to deal with finding the other two Grill Tang Sweets that I missed. As well as freeing all Mujina in the stage. I think it was called a distant dream. So this is just before we face Otaku Maru the first time. Turns out I did not go this way. Like I should have just gone right here. Because I was trying to find a way to get to that Kadama and I couldn't. But I didn't go between those houses. Well, apparently I had to take almost everything else before I can actually grab the Kadama. That was weird. Alright, so I'll cut ahead and meet you to where we can get the other Kadama in this level. Because there's nothing else in this stage besides the Kadama. Be right back. Okay, we're still in the same shack area, but instead of like going left where I found that path that led to the Kadama, we're actually going to go this way instead. Right over here so we can get on the rooftops. I don't remember us being here before. So why don't we just go on this way... At least I think this is the correct path. Yeah, you see that? There it is. It's on top of one of the roofs. On the rooftops. Perfect. You know what? I might as well just deal with this guy while we're here. So yeah, let's, let's just take him down. Nice. So I think that's the only thing we need to find left in this level. So I'm going to meet you at the next stage. Okay, this is around the second shrine of In Search of the Elixir. I do remember I missed a Kadama here, as well as a hot spring. And one of the sweets should be here too. So what I need to do is I need to go through the cave area. I did slaughter just about any enemy I could find. So that'll make my life a little bit easier. I don't think I'm supposed to climb through a ladder. But instead, I need to go through a path. I just gotta wonder where that path is. Wouldn't be over here. I'm trying to remember where exactly I gotta go next. But this should be the general area I need to head for. So why don't we go do that? Oh, there's a fake wall over here! You know what, let's make it mad. I don't care. I'm strong enough to deal with this thing anyway. So there you go. This leads to the, the second hot spring that I did not get. So at least we'll get something out of it by going here. That's a plus. Oh, that means I didn't get this treasure chest either. Oh, but it didn't have anything rare. Alright. Fine by me. It's not on... Oh wait, yes it is! It's right here! So I was just supposed to find the second hot spring, and that will get you the grill tang suite. So that's number two. We got one more to find. And that's in another level. Well, I guess we'll just have to keep on going to get that last Kadama. See how uh, we are nearby. What we need to do, is I think we gotta go up this way. Over into the ruins area. Which shouldn't be too bad. I mean, we dealt with this. It's pretty easy. Just gotta know where the trap is. So you don't step on it like an idiot. And might as well kill a couple aberrants while I'm at it. And you know, get shot right in the face. I'll just use the boss for a while. Why not? So it looks like the Kadama is not far from here. The question is, how the hell am I going to reach it? And it looks like it did elude me before. Oh, right. I remember this. 
Okay, I guess I won't get a chance to burst counter. That's okay, I didn't want to anyway. What are you talking about? Why would I want to do that? Okay, so I think I'm just supposed to proceed as normal, right? Like, just go through here. Not gonna bother with that chest. I think we should be getting closer to the Kadama. But it looks like it involved a wall. A wall that I did not take care of just yet. Oh, that opens up the shortcut for later. I think you're supposed to climb up? I'm not sure. But there was a wall that I should have dealt with and I didn't. Let me get this activated, just in case things go horribly wrong. I mean, it should. Seems how we're on normal difficulty again. I was gonna think, am I in the right area? Actually, this is the area right here. I think you're just supposed to shoot it. No, wait, not, not with the gun. Duh, you need the, the hand cannon. We'll do this one. It's, it's plus 10. Yeah, I didn't do anything with this before. Can't believe I overlooked that. And that should open this door, over here. With that, we can just grab these rewards. Not great, but not terrible either. And there's our Kadama. So we got the Spirit Guide trophy. That, that is for all the Kadama in the entire DLC. In fact, that should be all the Kadama in the entire game, period. Because there's not going to be a fourth DLC. I would be surprised if there was. Alright, so I think I gotta go through one more level to get what I missed, and that's a distant dream. So I'll meet you there. Alright, we are in this part of a distant dream just before you're supposed to face the Kinky. We're not gonna go this way. Instead, we gotta go right. Because it looks like we did miss one or two things over here. And in order to reach that, I think we just gotta go this way. First of all, let's, let's deal with this damn yokai. Okay, that was a bad idea on my part. That was also a bad idea on my part. Okay, there we go. We got his ass. I think we're supposed to go in here. Year. Well, let's just look around this way. Because I can see something smoldering. In fact, I think that was the hot spring that I missed. I don't know if I want to, like, sit on a bunch of skulls and feel relaxed by that. There, there's nothing relaxing about this. Skulls are hard, you know. <laughs> Humans and yokai both fear the other. Should we seek peace? We must cross these waters and find it. Alright, so let me see if I can find that Mujina, because I think there's one around here that I did not get. Also, because I didn't go to that hot spring, it turns out I never opened that shortcut before. Now, where did I see that shack? Is it this one? I don't even remember. Or no, I think I was here before. But it should be on the way. If I'm not mistaken. Hang on. Where would I have found this? Let's find out. I'm just gonna keep looking around. Don't know if it's that location. I wonder. 
Now this is gonna take me back to the hot spring. I don't wanna go to the hot spring this time. Over here, maybe? Did I not go in one specific spot? Now this one's just gonna take me back to the kinky. Again, I don't wanna go there. Oh, where the hell do I have to go? It's gotta be around here somewhere. This is back where I started. Again, there's the hot spring. I think it's this way. I don't remember going here. There's a pit. I don't know if I wanna go down the pit. Should I go down the pit? I think it might be safe to go down there. Yeah, it seems fine to me. I see something glowing. Oh, there he is! He wasn't in a cell! Yeah! Okay, so I have to do... I have to rescue all three in the same run. So I'll meet you back where I'm supposed to go to get that third grill tang piece. Alright, we made it back to this spot right here, still in a distant dream, where you fought that Kuroka variant and got the Ungyo key. So what you have to do, you get on the elevator, but as soon as it goes down, jump off immediately. That way you land on this ledge, and believe it or not, this ledge has the third and final Grill Tang Suite. So there we go, we have found all three at last. So what we have to do is we just gotta leave. How do I get the trophy for that? But I guess I didn't, for some reason I didn't get the trophy. Cause I know I grabbed the first one, like in uh, the demon one, Dawn of the Demon, I know I grabbed that particular one. There were three, right? Yeah, there were three. So we should be good. So why don't we just go back to Dream of the Strong, because that's where all my levels are completed. But now we can go to the interim. So I think one of the, the conditions to get through a stage was visit Mujina at the interim. So why don't we go ahead and do that now? I think we're just about close to finishing this DLC as a whole. Oh, you're not a Mujina. That's a Kappa. Hmm, where did it go? Where would I find them? Oh, there you are, you're right next to the Kappa. Alright, so we got ourselves a new mission. Alright, so let's just, uh, oh, why am I doing this? I can just go right here. It's been a while since I returned to the interim. In fact, when was the last time I was at the interim? The second DLC? I know I was there for the first one. I might have been there for the second, too. Alright, so new missions should be made available, finally. So we can go to A Spirit's Return. I think that's the one we just unlocked. And The Alluring Ancient, we can do that one too. In fact, we might as well do this one first. Recommended level 243. 
Did you happen to pick up something fragrant from somewhere? There was a most delightful scent wafting all around you. I have a funny feeling that kind of aroma might attract all manner of wild beasts. Looks like it's just a, a regular boss battle. Since ancient times, Mount Kurama has been a sacred place that only select individuals had the right to enter. Home to all manner of yokai, including the Tengu. These awe-inspiring mountain slopes were said to have been the training ground of the young Minamoto no Yoshitsune. As war intensified in the late Heian period with the rise of the samurai class, the mountain proved not to be immune to the dark forces that were abroad, and its sacred nature was steadily corrupted. Looks like something is waiting for me. I'll have to go to the other side of the waterfall. Mm, that smells good. Can't hand it over. Oh, the... It must be about the grill tank sweets. Ancient Neo Tengu. Oh, wait a minute. I've heard about this one. How's that character from Dead or Alive? Or at least based on a character from Dead or Alive. Oh, well, so much for that idea. Oh, wow. He actually kicked that right at me. No surprise it has the Kasha theme. Wait, is she catching my ninja stars? I just noticed they did no damage. Oh god, did she get summon illusions at you? So she's a little fierce. Whenever she throws the fireballs, be sure to sidestep when she's about to kick the fireball. Otherwise, you give her time to adjust her aim. That would be a pretty cool attack to use if I can unlock that. Ah, oh. oh, damn, I got burned anyway. Oh, that was a waste. God, she got me the grab again. Wait, does she have two different grab attacks? Yeah, I think so. All right, she's almost down. Got her in Dark Realm wind up, too. Beautiful! Just as she was about to draw me in. Okay, that was an interesting fight. Oh, such promise. I think I'm in love. <laughs> right, let me take your soul core while I'm at it. Just for the record, I have not played a single Dead or Alive game. If I'm just to be completely honest. <laughs> now, would I play a Dead or Alive game? Uh, possibly. Not too keen on multiple, like, fighting series. But you never know. Well, I did warn you, although it wasn't a wild beast precisely. In truth, I had heard rumors of the ancient Neo Tengu before, but I never thought they would be so ravishing. Surely there's never a dull moment on the road with you, is there? You're a talking cat, but I'm the exciting one. Alright, let's see what else we gotta do. We still can't do a familiar glow yet. So what we have to do is we have to go to a spirit's return. Uh, I think I'll save that for the next episode. Should I? No, I say we go for it now. I cannot comprehend it. Otakemaru has been vanquished, 
yet countless Nikitama are still at large in Onaiga Castle. Is it possible they are being held captive by a yokai we failed to defeat? We must investigate! Sure, why not? Let's go. Alright, so... There's only two more levels left to, to do, and we're done with the DLC. Holy crap. <laughs> I didn't take into account, like, uh, the uh, other parts of this video that I split up, so I hope it's not gonna be too long. So we just gotta rescue a bunch of Mujina, right? Oh, but first... Let's level up! Put another point in Dex. I'd say it's time we get this show on the road. It has been like well over a week or two since the last time I did the previous episode. So good to know my gameplay hasn't gotten too rusty. Oh, Yokai Gauntlet! Okay, do I have to rescue a bunch of Mushinas or only one? Oh, thank god I eliminated one yokai before that guy appeared. So I was not looking forward to facing a Namahage with backup. Ow. Okay. I don't know what's actually worse. Oh, come on! Seriously? There were so few frames to know when that grab was coming. I just want to try to kill this damn skeleton! Are you kidding me? Again! Jeez. Why is killing one skeleton so much work? Wait a minute. This one's a different color. Wait, what? Unless I'm losing my mind. This one looks like it's wearing green. I don't know I found the Luigi version of this yokai. Man, he always seems to get me when I'm not prepared. Oh, come on! Can't catch a break with these grab moves! Okay, I got him with poison. Oh, there's a Mujina. Oh, what, 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 wait a minute. I don't know there was a, a Bakagani among them. Alright, so where are we going? Here? Sure, let's go there. I'm gonna try... Okay, why did the... Why did this start freezing for a while? Otherworldly Akiko? <laughs> no thanks. So it looks like I gotta do with maybe four rounds of enemies. One for each of the four demons in a distant dream. Then I get a Mujina after each one. At least that's what I'm gathering out of all this. Alright, you get some uh, protection as well. Can't go this way. Oh! Yeah, giant enemy crab decided to go right into my grill. And not in my pot of boiling water. What a pity. Well, at least I'm doing this one with backup. More than what I had before. Get 
All right, the Kiki is next. Whoa, wait a minute, wait a minute. Did we get the backup? I think we got it. Okay, I thought that Mugina actually died on me. Nope, it's still in it. Ooh, how did I dodge that grab? I thought I was just trapped. Yeah, right in the belly. Ooh, I got a Mujina with me. I think there's another one around here. Wait, isn't that where we came from? What? Huh. I guess, guess we'll take a Scampus, too. Hang on, which way did we come from? Actually, I think it was this bridge that we took. And then you go down here. Maybe you don't get a Mujina each time. Because I did try... Getting them all in the previous stage of Distant Dream. You can only have one Mujina in play at a time. See, so you can't have, like, more than one. That would have made for a pretty good army. I mean, everybody looked like me. I think that would have been pretty rad. Ooh, oh, toxic slime. Oh, come on, you dickhead. Oh, Sweetie wants to play already. Oh, I should not have let go of my guard. Beautiful. You're still dealing with this thing for real? What the hell? Oh, this gauntlet's not even done. This is how I gotta bring in the Kuroka variant. There it is. Oh Man, these old guys are actually being more smart than I thought. They, they wait for me to use an attack that has a lot of wind-up, and then do a grab. I lost count how many times that's happened so far. And <laughs> we drowned them. What a loser. Whoa, 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 whoa! Fujiwara no Chikala? Did I ever face you once? No. What is your role in all this? I mean, Fujiwara is something I heard about in the first DLC. Then why are you here? I think we should start eliminating this backup first. But yeah, I remember, like, the Fuji... No, it's not the Fuji War. It was the Tyra that was the issue. In the first DLC. That's it, we're done. Ooh, we got Reverse Impact. What is reverse impact? Is that for the sword? Oh, hi. Oh, wow. There's a lot of peeps here. Oh, 
Oh, so wholesome. Look at all the yokai we've rescued through all this. Alright, we're done with this level. Ah, look at that machine, he's just happy. It's like, yeah! <laughs> Alrighty then. <laughs> Let's keep it going. So, it was a revenant that was leading the yokai? Well, if that is the case, it was most likely Fujiwara no Chikata. He, it was said he was able to get four demons to aid him in a revolt. Though you must know how that turned out. Now, even after being subdued, he has chosen to return as a revenant to cause strife. Evidently, he has not learned his lesson. Ah, what a tragedy. Still, with those yokai taken care of, the Nikitama should find some peace of mind once again. And we got a ninja's locks too, for our troubles. Alright, so it looks like we got one level left, a familiar glow. And after that, we've completed the entire DLC. Okay, reverse impact is right here. Stab your throne to the ground and slash upwards as you wrench it free. Interesting. Don't know if I'll actually use it. Because I haven't really used swords much. Elemental damage taken reduced, yes. Alright, if this is the only level left to do, we might as well just have this be a lengthy episode. Because we're almost done. Alright, the last mission. A familiar glow. How marvelous! Sahayamaru's light shines forth once more. Given where it has led us thus far, this can only be some kind of omen. It seems the blade is calling to us once again. All right, let's go. We're back here in Onaga Castle for the final level of the DLC. Oh, wait a minute. Tokichiro? Do not worry. Huh, welcome back, man. Come, let us begin. I guess we can only have one benevolent grave active at a time. So I would have liked to have been able to summon who else is here. Alright, better make sure everybody's well protected. Oh, you again! Well, at least I have backup for this! That's right, Tokichiro, keep him distracted! Oh wow, I actually cancelled the grab move! Oh shit. Look how much his health is melting. Oh. Okay, back away. And somehow Tokichiro didn't even kick the bucket yet. I thought he would have been taking a little big brunt of the damage at this time. Got him. That's it? Huh. We only had to fight one boss. <laughs> yeah, you're pretty tough, Eddie. <laughs> and he has departed. 
I'm guessing the other benevolent greys were other people that have helped us in our journey. I figured I'd try this with at least, you know, enlisting one ally once. Because it was free. The original samurai. God damn. That was one hell of an experience. I don't know where in the world we are, but it's great to see you again. It seems whatever bond we share can't be got rid of that easily. Yep, we're partners forever, Hitty. Well, it seems it's about time to part ways. But be sure to stop by again. You don't have anywhere better to be, right? Not anymore. Alright, good stuff. So I... I think we're done. There's nothing else in the entire game. We completed the DLC. Everything is all good. Yep, we, we did it all. Hang on, is there anything new on tutorials? I don't think there is. No, there isn't. Okay, I guess we're 100% done. I mean, there's all this. And there might be stuff that I can do, but I would have to, like, beat this game at a higher difficulty, so I probably won't worry about that now. But yeah, I think we're done with Neo 2 for good. I think there's another mode called the Underworld, which I haven't unlocked. Which, again, I might have to beat this game in Dream of the Demon to achieve. And my skill level is nowhere near that point for which I can do it. But in due time, it could happen. Just not now. So I think we'll just say that for maybe the future. Could be a stream project. Who knows? But for now, I'm just done with this game altogether. For YouTube, at least. So, this is the Bonga signing off, saying goodbye, Godspeed, and stay tuned for my next Let's Play. Thanks for watching, everybody, and I shall see you next time.